Hello everybody, ciao a tutti e benvenuti a una nuova lezione di italiano. Io sono Daniela di Speak Italian with Daniela. Today we are going to do Italian syllables pronunciation. I'm going to mm, read the Italian sentences slowly so you can understand and listen to the pronunciation but I've written the English translation so you can follow and understand what I'm saying. So let's start this important part of phonetic and grammar about Italian language and let's start the lesson. Oggi vi introdurrò un suono fonetico importante nella lingua italiana, le sillabe. Una sillaba è la combinazione tra una vocale ed una consonante. Perché facciamo questo esercizio? Perché è importante per esercitare la tua abilità di ascolto e la tua abilità nel parlare e perché le parole italiane sono formate da sillabe. Quindi iniziamo. Ve le leggerò e voi le potete ripetere dopo di me. Divertitevi. Enjoy. Per comprendere e parlare italiano in modo corretto, devi conoscere i suoni fonetici di questa lingua. Focus on the sound, not on the spelling. So, we're going to start from we did the vowels in the last lesson and today we are going to do the consonant plus the vowels that are the syllables, okay? So let's start with the B sound. B, what's in Italian? B, ba, be, bi, bo, bu. You can repeat after me. Ba, be, bi, bo, Bu. Ba baby bo bu. The letter C, C in Italiano, these letters combined has two sounds, K and CH. K sound. Ka, ke, ki, ko, ku. I repeat. Ka, ke, Chi, co, cu. Ch sound. Cha, che, chi, cho, chu. I repeat. Cha, che, chi, cho, chu. Okay, the letter E. After the, the C, the letter C, makes the sound soft, okay? Ch, not strong as K, okay? Let's move on. D. Da, de, di, do, du. I repeat. Da, de, di, do, du. F, F, Fa, Fe, Fi, Fo, Fu. Then we have the G sound again. Also, this letter has two sounds. G, the get, and J, like Jim. 
So the g sound. Ga, ge, gi, go, gu. Ga, ge, gi, go, gu. J sound. Ja, o jia. Jia, j, ji, jo, ju. Ja, j, ji, jo, ju. The H letter, the H sound in Italian, the H letter doesn't have a sound, so we skip this letter. L, la, le, li, lo, lu. I repeat. You can repeat after me. La, le, li, lo. Lu. M. M. Ma. Me. Mi. Mo. Mu. Ma. Me. Mi. Mo. Mu. N. Na. Ne. Ni, no, nu. Na, ne, ni, no, nu. P. Pa, pe, pi, po, pu. I repeat. Pa, pe, pi, po, pu. The ku that has the sound, but also when you read the ku in Italian, you have to put the u after. So qua, que, qui, quo, ku. Qua, que, qui, quo, ku. R, ra, re, ri, ro, ru. Ra, re, ri, ro, ru. The R sound is very round and you have to pronounce quite strong. S, sa, se, si. So, su. I repeat. Sa, se, si, so, su. Ti. Ta, te, ti, to, tu. Ta, te. Ti, to, tu. Vi, va, ve, vi, vo, vu. Va, ve, vi, vo, vu. And Z, zeta. This letter has two sounds. Z and Z. Z. The other one is like a mosquito. Z. So, Z and Z. Z and Z. Yeah. Out with Z, the air in inside with Z. So, I'm going to read in both. As you can see, the, the written is the same, but 
what change changes the sound. So with z sound, sa, ze, zi, zo, zu. So repeat, sa, ze, zi, zo, zu. With z, za, ze, zi, zo, zu. Repeat, za, ze, zi, zo, zu. So it's important that you practice these syllables and make sure that these sounds are very open and very clear. So for example, when you have uh, ve or te is not te, te with the y, with the y sound that is typical, for example, in the English language. So it's te, it's not T or is not T, and the same when the the word end with O is O not O, so is to, so, ro, vo, okay, non vo, okay. This is very important. So thank you for watch this video. Please exercise and make sure that you are uh, that you can become more confident with these sounds, with these Italian sounds. And uh, if you have comment or question, please write them below. Leave a thumb up. Subscribe to this channel for more and useful videos about grammar. And also about, I'm thinking to do something about Italian culture or daily basis in the Italian life. So stay tuned. And again, thank you for watching the video. E ci vediamo. Ciao.